Hey crazy friends, it's Jay with Find You Crazy. We're a family of nine who live full-time in our RV with five of our kids as we go around the country to see every national park. Today is another maintenance video. When you live with this many people in a camper or when you live full-time in a camper anyway, sometimes it's the really small things that make a really, really big difference. And today we're going to talk about something that made a huge difference, a little bitty thing like a crossbar. So today we're going to show you how to install this crossbar on the screen door of your camper uh, and it has made a huge difference for us i put this on several months ago uh, it's super cheap super quick to put in um, but it has made a giant difference i mean when you've got seven people in a camper sometimes eight sometimes ten going in and out of this door that means this thing's getting open like a million times a day and so to make that easier a little bit easier to grab hold of um, especially for our special needs twins um, this thing has made a giant difference. We have absolutely loved it. So let's flash back to when we put it on. Okay, right, so our next project on the screen doors is we're going to put in a crossbar handle uh, on the screen door. Um, they don't come with it, but we have read that it really makes a big difference. Uh, and especially for us, my poor wife, since there's nowhere to grab, a lot of times we'll grab the edge and pull it in. And she's uh, pinched her fingers more than once. Um, so we're going to put a bar right across here. All right, so the one that we bar we got is from RV Guard. We got it off Amazon. I'll put the link down in the description. Um, here is everything is pretty simple that came in the box. Uh, you got the two ends that will screw into the door, two bars uh, to attach to each one of those, uh, and then the center one, uh, which basically makes it adjustable to any size door, uh, and then the screws that go with it. Uh, the only hardware that you're going to need is a drill and a drill bit um, because obviously this doesn't have uh, the screw holes to exactly where you're going to need to put your bar. Uh, and then uh, a little bit of tape to hold it in place uh, while you drill it. And then a uh, um, Phillips head to screw everything together. So pretty simple. So the first thing to do is to figure out the placement on the door. Uh, and so you want to kind of dry fit uh, yours together. So those go in the end. And as I said, this will go here. And then that's adjustable um, so that you can get the right length uh, on the door. So I think we're gonna put ours just above about right there, um, just above this crossbar, that'll give it a good place to uh, screw in. Uh, and so basically we just want to level it out. And I'm just gonna use, instead of using a level, I'm just gonna use this mark uh, right here on the door. Uh, if you don't have a nice mark like that, you may want to get a level and actually level it out. There we go. So we've marked uh, the four holes. And so now we'll take it down. We'll screw uh, these two in um, and then measure uh, the distance for uh, this to make sure that we got it centered. Right, now that we've got it screwed together, um, we're going and marked where it's going to go. We're going to hold it up because the next thing is we need to center this black piece uh, in the middle. And so to do that, you can either screw it in, then unscrew it. I guess you could clamp it, or you could get two great assistants like I have. This is Christopher and Joseph, and they're going to be my clamps and hold it together. All right, boys, so hold it right there. Hold it back here, pinch it against the door. 
See how I'm kind of holding the door and the thing? There you go. Perfect. All right, and then once it's in place, you're just going to measure the two sides uh, to adjust the black thing, and then we're going to tape it um, in place so that it doesn't move so before we drill it. And it's already on. Now we're just going to tape it in place. We're gonna go and I let go, boys. Now we're gonna pre-drill these holes um, and drill the drill the screws in, and then we've got our bar ready. Uh, and then all we gotta do is come back and uh, mount it. All right, now that we've got our bar put together, uh, we're ready to mount it up here. Uh, and so we've marked our holes, and so we're just going to punch them, drill them, and then screw it in. And there you are. That simple. You got a nice new crossbar for your screen door.